Hi everyone, my name is Thomas Kim. Today is May 16th, 2021. This is my second episode about QT6 and 3D graphics with Vulkan. Disclaimer, I know nothing about Vulkan nor about QT6. I film this series of videos to teach myself, not my audience. I created a new playlist. If you double click this link, you can find four videos in this playlist. These are my previous videos. If you have difficulties following my current and future sessions, you probably have to watch my previous videos listed here, especially you need to install Python package on Windows. Also, if you have a problem installing Vulkan, please watch this video. This is Vulkan SDK Home. Double click it. Docs. Getting started with Windows Vulkan SDK. If you scroll down, System Requirements, Windows 10. 64-bit OS, Vulkan installable client driver from your GPU hardware vendor. That's why I installed NVIDIA CUDA toolkit on Windows. You need sufficient memory, sufficient free disk space on your hard drive. You also need CMake. On your command prompt, cmake version. My current version is 3.20. So, cmake version 3.10 or above. Python 3 or newer. Python version Python 3.8. So, Python 3.0 or newer. Visual Studio 2017 or 2019. We are using CL version. This is Visual Studio 2019. Or you can say Microsoft Compiler version. This is Visual Studio 2019. Now In the SDK, double click this link. Show in folder. Now I will close all open applications. Double click this installer. Yes, I agree. We will install it in the default folder. Click install. Now click finish. Please note that this installer can make changes to system environment variables. I would highly recommend you to reboot your machine. My current session continues after rebooting my machine. I've just restarted my machine. Right click, search, environment, edit system environment variables, environment variables. If you scroll down, you can find VK SDK path, Vulkan SDK 1.2 blah blah blah. If you find this environment variable, you installed Vulkan SDK correctly. Click OK. Click OK. Click Start. Vulkan Cube. If it runs correctly, your Vulkan SDK functions correctly. Now close it. If you are having problem installing Python, please watch this video. Install Python official package on Windows. Also, 
If you have problem installing Vulkan SDK, please watch this video too.